that when you have something great and people um, see that, the happier you are, the more they kind of come after it. Different stuff, a uh, bunch of text messages from all of the speculation interpretations about something that I said on a podcast. Somewhere. Because it's so unheard of. So I'm very proud of that. We are currently separated. Okay. Uh, we are not talking about divorce. A different job with her, making sure she feels safe and comfortable and secure. My job's not done. You gotta start off with a really solid foundation, especially if you're gonna be doing reality television. Um, and we were dealing with our own issues internally and it all came out and et cetera, et cetera. Whatever we did work, and we don't wanna mess with the good things. Saving his marriage. Oh man, let me tell you about Mauricio Umansky's unwavering determination to salvage his marriage with Kyle Richards it's like something out of a movie, seriously. So here's the scoop. Despite all the juicy gossip and confirmation of their separation, Mauricio, the hotshot real estate broker, isn't waving the white flag just yet. Nope, he's all in for saving his love story with Kyle Richards. First things first, Mauricio made it loud and clear that they're not throwing in the towel. Yeah, they might be living apart and all that jazz, but there's no giving up on this love train, and they've been at this game since 1996, people. That's like an eternity in Hollywood years, so they're not about to let that history crumble without a fight. I feel like if you've been married for 20 years in Beverly Hills, it's like being married for 100 years. That when you have something great and people um, see that, the happier you are, the more they kind of come after it. We are currently separated. Okay. Uh, we are not talking about divorce. Mauricio spilled the beans that they're working their butts off behind the scenes. You can imagine him saying, hey, we've got issues, we're not denying that, but we're not going down without a fight. It's that kind of determination that makes you root for them, you know? And then there's the kicker. Mauricio is talking to the fans directly. He's telling everyone who's listening that they're giving this relationship one more shot. It's like watching Rocky Balboa come out for the final round. Fists up, ready to give it his all. You can't help but cheer him on. So there you have it. The real deal on Mauricio Umansky's never say die attitude when it comes to his marriage with Kyle Richards. It's like a roller coaster ride of emotions. But hey, who doesn't love a good love story with a plot twist? Let's just hope this determination pays off and they come out stronger on the other side. Go, Mauricio, go! That definitely was the highlight of the ride for me when I finally made it to the top somewhere else because it's so unheard of. So I'm very proud of that. My husband and I, I think that we're a really good team. We're complete opposites. Explosive rumors and marital woes. You won't believe the drama that's brewing in The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills season 13. It's juicier than a ripe watermelon on a hot summer day. And it's all about Kyle Richards and Mauricio Umansky's roller coaster relationship. So the trailer for this season? Explosive is an understatement. It's like they cranked up the drama dial to 11 you get a front row seat to the turbulence in Kyle and Mauricio's marriage. It's like watching a soap opera, but with real people. The trailer spills the tea on the rumors swirling around these two. We're talking allegations of infidelity, folks. The cast members are buzzing about it, and you can practically see the gossip bubbling over. It's like a pot of spaghetti sauce simmering on the stove, and everyone wants a taste. But wait, there's more. The trailer also gives you a peek behind the curtain into how Kyle and Mauricio dropped the bombshell of their separation on their kids. You can survive anything. <laughs> if you can survive a marriage on reality TV, you can survive it all. There's no okay. question. Different stuff, a uh, bunch of text messages from all of the speculation and interpretations about something that I said on a podcast. Talk to me, what's happening? Oh, I picked up some of this furniture. I went furniture shopping with Faye today. Talk about an emotional roller coaster. You can practically feel the tension through the screen as they navigate those tricky waters. And then there's the reactions of the other housewives. Some of them are playing the supportive BFF role, offering tissues and comforting words. It's all, you've got this Kyle and we're here for you girl, like a sisterhood of drama queens. But of course, there's always some shade thrown in the mix. Some housewives are side-eyeing the situation, questioning whether there's more to the story it's like they've got their detective hats on, trying to unravel the truth. It's like a high-stakes game of who's telling the truth and who's playing games. There's our sneak peek into the explosive rumors and marital woes taking center stage in The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills Season 13. Buckle up, folks, because this season is going to be a wild ride, and you won't want to miss a minute of the drama.
together with an athletic event was just one of the best trips of my life. I plant the story in order to create uh, ratings, in order to create all kinds of different things. Look amazing. You like this? Yeah. Should I wear this every day? Relationship struggles unveiled. Strap in, because it's been a rocky journey for these two lovebirds. So imagine being married for a whopping 27 years. That's like a lifetime in Hollywood, where relationships often come and go faster than you can say red carpet. But for Kyle and Mauricio, this past year has been a real test of their bond. First things first, they didn't keep it all hush-hush. Nope. They went all out and dropped a joint statement on Instagram. It's like the modern-day version of taking out a full-page ad in the newspaper to announce your relationship status. Hi, honey. What's up? How are you? That's my rack of extra clothes. You gotta start off with a really solid foundation, especially if you're gonna be doing reality television. Kyle and I were not separated. Okay. And that's what I was referring to. We were not separated. What about you? My least favorite thing about Kyle is just she's just, um, she's stubborn. In that post, they laid it all out. The struggles, the challenges, but also the love and respect they have for each other. It's like saying, yeah, we've had some rough patches, but we're still in this together. And then there's the season. Picture this. The camera's rolling, the lights flashing, and Kyle's castmates looking on in shock as she navigates the minefield of her crumbling marriage. It's like a real-life soap opera unfolding right before your eyes. You've got Dorrit and PK, her close friends, expressing their disbelief at the situation. It's like they're saying, wait, what's happening? But it's not all tears and support. There's drama too. Erica Jane swoops in with some tough love, telling Kyle that there's only two people in this marriage and everyone else's opinion can take a hike. And then there's Sutton Strack, who thinks Kyle might be in denial and maybe even lying about something. It's like a Real Housewives showdown. And what's this about infidelity rumors? Crystal Kung Minkoff's housekeeper Lucy hints at it. And Sutton, always ready to spill the tea, says, Where there's smoke, there's fire. It's like they're playing detective, trying to figure out what's really going on. The inside scoop on Kyle Richards and Mauricio Umansky's relationship roller coaster. It's a mix of love, drama, and a whole lot of mystery. Will they make it through? Well, you'll just have to tune in and find out. This season of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills is going to be one for the books. Oh, I'm going to take it in here. <laughs> Stop. Whatever we did work, and we don't want to mess with a good thing. I want, to, I want to clear things up, okay? Okay. Kyle and I are human beings. Controversial cheating allegations. Hold on to your seats, because this drama train just keeps on chugging along. We're talking about those controversial cheating allegations and the jaw-dropping denials in the world of the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. It's like the never-ending plot twist that keeps you glued to your screen. So rewind to that scene in the trailer where Mauricio Umansky seems to be making light of affair rumors. I have a different job with her, making sure she feels safe and comfortable and secure. My job's not done. Because we're like, what we, we know what we have. Then you glue together because you're, you're like, it's and then you're flying together. Right. together. Um, but uh, we are having our issues, um, and I hope that sets the record straight. It shouldn't be in here. Well, honey, I don't know where to put my extra clothes. It doesn't fit in the closet. Well, then I have get it. rid of it. I'm talking, and it's like a puzzle piece that doesn't quite fit. And speaking of rumors, the trailer drops some major hints that infidelity might be lurking in the shadows of Kyle and Mauricio's marriage. It's the kind of suspense that keeps you speculating late into the night. Are these just whispers, or is there some truth hiding in plain sight? But the housewives, oh boy, they're not sitting on the sidelines. They're like a team of detectives with their own theories. Some are ready to point fingers, raising eyebrows at the possibility of infidelity. It's like they're saying, hey, where there's smoke, there's fire, right? On the flip side, there are those who've got their doubts about Kyle's side of the story. They're not buying into the narrative and think she might be in denial or perhaps even stretching the truth. It's like they've got their detective hats on, scrutinizing every detail. And the answer was we did not plant the story. As a matter of fact, at the time that the story came out from People.com... What about? Well, in Vegas. She said things and I said... Um, and we were dealing with our own issues internally and it all came out and etc, etc. 
impact on family. Hold on to your heartstrings, folks, because it's time to talk about the impact on family, Kyle Richards' daughters, and the immediate family's response to this roller coaster of a marriage. So, picture this. In the trailer, there's a heart-wrenching family meeting between Kyle, Mauricio, and their daughters. It's like a tidal wave of emotions crashing down. You can practically feel the weight of the world on their shoulders, the tears flowing like a river. It's a raw, unfiltered look at how those marital struggles have taken a toll on their family bonds. But it's not all doom and gloom. And whenever I have strong. a friend I care about that I feel like is upset or, you know, having an argument. Have conversations with our kids. We've had conversations with our family. That's actually brought us closer together and it's been really, really nice. You are? Yeah, I'm going to go over there and talk to her for a little while. Yeah, for the house here? Yes, I saw some gorgeous, like, more modern looking chandeliers for here. Yeah. Uh, privately, it's very hard when everybody interprets everything you said. When I answered the question on that podcast... I hate that I didn't go to college. So that's why it's so important for me that my kids go. To me, what's happening? Oh, I picked up some of this furniture. I went furniture shopping at Faye today. Uh, you know, asking me what I said and what that looked like and, you know, et cetera, et cetera. And basically... Um, it's hard and it's paid off and I could not be more proud. Kyle, she's the rock in all of this chaos. She steps up and it's like watching a mama bear protecting her cubs. She reassures her family that no matter what happens, they'll always be a strong, unbreakable unit. It's a touching moment that reminds you of the power of family love, even in the toughest of times. And let's not forget how this family dynamic adds depth to the story. It's like peeling back the layers of an onion revealing the complexity of their relationship. You see how the couple's struggles ripple through their daughters' lives, and it's both heartwarming and heart-wrenching at the same time.